go, Brandon. I'll just get one of you for one second. Good. Thanks, Sam. Yes. You betcha. Awesome. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. What's up, guys? Hey, hey Brandon. Brandon. I'm Stacy. This is Joanne. We're Survivor Con Fans Podcast. Congratulations for making it so far in the game. So, how are you chosen to be on Survivor? Um, I just made a video. Uh, my uncle had some contacts with CBS, and I made a video, sent it to him, and uh, that's pretty much how it worked. They called me. They they liked me. I had to go through the same process anybody else had to, and interviews and stuff like that, and I made it. What was your pitch in the video? Did, uh, did you start with, I'm going to redeem the family name? No, I didn't. I started with uh, Russell. You know, that's pretty much it. Anything and everything he did, I mimicked, and it uh, got me on the game. But what kept me on the game was my faith in Christ. And uh, if I would have played like Russ, I wouldn't have made it as far as I did. And I'm appreciative of how far I made it in the game. And I'm thankful for getting this opportunity. So how did playing in the game affect your faith? Uh, it made it stronger. I know who I am now, man. I just, when I, I, when I could see and, and capitalize on the things that I did wrong, and you don't, you don't really get to replay your life. You do something wrong, you don't get a videotape of it. And, you can't capitalize on that. It's like sometimes you forget. This is this ain't never going to be forgotten. I've made mistakes publicly, and now I can capitalize those lies on those things publicly. So it's 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 a uh, I don't know. The good outweighs the bad. So. so when you and Albert sat down, what what transpired? How, how did your mind change? What what prompted you to go ahead and do that? I gave him my word. I told him if he was ever in trouble, I'd give him my idol. That was it. That's all it took. You know, what was the game, why did, why did I even start out playing a truthful and honest game in the first place? If I'm not going to continue to do it, I'd have been looked, like, as a, looked at as a liar. And, you know, you can't win for losing sometimes. People are going to be mad because you gave it up, and people are going to be mad because you kept it to yourself. You know, that showed. Coach didn't win, and he played pretty, you know, jacked up in some situations. And, you know, sometimes you lose when you do bad, and you lose when you do good. I mean, you know, it's just how it is. It is what it is. What happened on day seven? Day seven changed me, man. I, uh, I realized that I wasn't out there to play for me. I was out there to play for people who needed encouragement. And believe it or not, a lot of people were encouraged by the way that I played, and it gave them the strength to make that next step with their faith in God, and I'm proud of that. And uh, that means more, way more. Somebody's soul, somebody's life, eternity, it means so much more than a million dollars. You can't put money to it. It's, it's, it's an amazing trade. So who did you vote for? Sophie. I voted for Sophie. Um, I was a little bit bitter. That's just the um, zit. You You're know? saying that was a vote not for coach? Well, it was a vote not for coach. It was. Uh, this is just the truth. It don't sugarcoat it or nothing. I was upset that coach did that to me. And um, I was in the heat of passion. I, I forgave him, but I didn't vote for him. You know? <laughs> we kind of said, I started down, playing the you? game that day. I said, you know what? I'll play Survivor right now. Did you promise him you would never write his name down? Yes, and I kept that promise. So it worked out for everybody. I noticed you had a real reaction when Sophie revealed that uh, Coach had duped you with the idol, that he already had it when he was praying for him. A little bit low, in my opinion. Uh, I wouldn't go that, that way, that route. It's just not, that ain't, I don't mess with stuff like that. I don't mess with people's beliefs. And uh, that's just a line that I wouldn't cross. It's, it's in the game of Survivor, you know. You'll do what you got to do uh, to win Survivor. And, you know, just like life, you know, some people do anything to, for money. They'll do anything for popularity. And, you know, that's unfortunate, but my character means more to me. So is there any one thing that keeps going over and over in your head that you wish you had done differently? Oh, I wish, I wish I'd have done, uh, made better decisions, not based off of emotion, but based off of, you know, what I knew was right. And sometimes I did fall to, you know, being upset and, and allowing my emotions to blow up. And I, you've seen a lot of reactions from me through the season. And all of those reactions weren't always good, you know, best intentions, but then just don't get you nowhere, especially a million dollars. So, uh, you know, yeah, I do regret doing the things that I did. Some. But I don't regret how I played the game. It, 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 Win-win situation. So what's next for you? Survivor. No, uh, going back to my home, building a home, for my, me and my family. But I, I will be back, and I'll see Russell face-to-face, -face and it's going to be fun.
Now, a lot of people are saying, a lot of the fans are saying, they think that Sean's going to go on the show next. Do you think there's any possibility of that? I have no idea. I, that would you be, haven't discussed it yet? No, we hadn't discussed my dad. Well, it's always been it's a funny thing to talk about. I wouldn't be surprised at all, uh, but it'd be fun. <laughs> all three of us? Yes. Unfair advantage for Russell. I wouldn't I wouldn't think he would have a shot at that one. No, but uh, yeah, we, we'll joke around. Are you around saying you'd gang up against him? Of course. That's my daddy, you know. <laughs> no, he'd tag him down for me. I'd sit back and... You know, watch it now, but it'll be fun. No, it's great. We enjoyed, we Thank enjoyed you so watching much, all Brandon. facets of you, Brandon. Okay. <laughs> all, all eight yeah. And just for you,